this thing on. I'm guessing y'all think that I pretty much died since it's been two months since I've uploaded, unless you follow me on like other social media. But I also guess that my channel's pretty dead, so I don't even know how many people will see. Because every time a battle royale comes out, my channel pops off with it, then the battle royale dies, and then we repeat the process, and uh, that's been going on for what, four BRs now? After Anaria, I kind of just stepped away from the gaming scene for a little while, and recently the only thing that I've been playing is Among Us a lot, and Warzone some. I've actually gotten into Warzone really late. And I don't really know where I'm going with this video, I kind of just wanted to make an update video and kind of talk for a little while for whoever still actually wants to watch my videos. I know I get a lot of requests from certain people to stream or to make YouTube videos still. But it's kind of hard to make YouTube videos, especially for me personally, because I always stuck with H1 and always kind of stuck with the BR genre and never branched out to any other content. So any other time I branch out to anything other than like H1, and obviously H1 is pretty much gone at this point, YouTube completely screws me on algorithm. And who knows, it might do it on this video too. I still would love to stream and make YouTube videos if I had something to make content on, but for me personally, there's really nothing that I enjoy enough to actually strive to make content on. And personally, I don't want to give up all that time again just to try to grind to have another moment on a game because you usually get one moment, one in the fame moment, and that was me with H1, and then I wrote out it until it pretty much had nothing else to give. But you know, when I was younger, when I was like 12, 13, I guess, I always said that I wanted to be an, a, a YouTuber, and I still will stand by that I always wanted to be a YouTuber. I always thought it was cool to have people that watched you, cared about your content, and I still would like to have that. You know, it's still like a dream for me, but honestly, I chased the dream into the dirt, and there's really nothing left. But to be fair, I had a shit ton of fun in my time of streaming and making YouTube videos, and there's a lot of people that have grinded a lot longer than I did that never made anything of it. Obviously, I had a lot of in the fame moments, had big streamers watch me, big streamers to play with. I got a lot of friends that have, you know, made huge YouTube channels. I have personally had like three, four, five thousand viewers on streams of mine before, and my hometown's population is like half that. Like that type of shit is absolutely insane to me. Not to mention people like the doc who the other day, you know, he watched me in front of like 400,000 viewers. I've had Shroud talk to me in front of, you know, all these thousands of viewers. And it's, you know, it's kind of some people think that it's just normal everyday thing. Like they're just normal people. But it's really cool to have those moments in the spotlight and stuff, at least for me. I mean, everybody's different. I just remember back when I first got into H1 and started making H1 YouTube videos, I would go into the lobbies and there would be like 150 people in there and somebody would say, oh, it's Cam. And then all of a sudden there was, you know, 50, 60 people following me around saying it's cam it's cam like that kind of shit was cool to me and it's not the whole like you feel like a superstar or some shit like type of vibe it's just it's cool that people recognize you and what like your content enjoy watching you that type of stuff like that means more to me than any of the money or viewership or anything did just having people that recognized you liked your content told you that they enjoyed your content but by no means is this a video saying I'm like gonna stop making YouTube videos or stop doing anything like drop off the face of the planet or some shit. I'm still on Twitter every single day. If you want to go follow my Twitter, it'll be down in the description. I tweet stupid shit on a day to day basis pretty much. But I really hope that eventually whenever the time comes, me and a couple of buddies have talked about a few different times about getting an apartment together, getting a house together, something like that. Whenever I actually could have a place where I was moved out and not having to worry about being loud, not having to worry about any anything like that not having to worry about keeping people awake that is when I would like to get back into like at least streaming every once in a while doing stuff every once in a while I still play among us every night like I said but I'm usually playing 2 3 a.m. and my dad gets up for work at like 4 or 5 a.m. so I have to be extremely quiet I couldn't be streaming stuff like that not to mention most of the people that still watch me are from Europe so they aren't even like I mean they might be awake by then it's you know early early morning for them but even then it would be like a really bad time to stream so far though I've been enjoying Cold War so I might uh, try to get into the Warzone side of it because obviously they're transferring Warzone over to Cold War, 
when it comes out and it's still going to have the BR in it. And that would be fun to do content on. The only thing that worries me is that it needs a mega PC to run it. I mean, I can run the beta right now pretty decently. I have a 1080 and an i7-6700K with like 16 gigs of RAM. But when it comes out, you know, I definitely could not stream off that one PC and have more than like negative five FPS. So I don't really know what I'm going to do. I just kind of wanted to make this YouTube video today because I was really bored and I'm home alone and like there's nothing going on right now. I don't have anything to do for the day. So I thought I would put this YouTube video together, kind of talk about things catch up whatever to the maybe like five people that'll watch this video i really appreciate the shit out of you to every single person that still messages me and gets onto my ass saying to stream and saying to make youtube videos and all that stuff i really really you don't even understand how much i appreciate you because like it still means the world to me even if like five people want to watch a video or a stream of mine because at the end of the day, I don't think I'm any special content creator. At the actual facts, I think I am a terrible content creator, but a lot of people have always liked to watch me and told me that I was entertaining, told me I had a good personality, told me all this stuff, and it really made me happy that people did get an enjoyment out of watching my dumbass. So to end off the video, I hope you guys are doing well. Hope everybody enjoyed the video, and I'll talk to you whenever I make the next one. Appreciate it. Bye.